From ABC News, live in Times Square, this is Good Morning America with Robin. Now we're going to go to the shapewear war that is heating up right now this morning. Real Housewives star of New York, Heather Thompson, and the billionaire founder of shapewear brand Spanx are going head to head. ABC's Lindsay Janice has the very latest on this battle. There's a shapewear showdown ramping up this morning. Hi, my name is Heather Thompson. On one side, Heather Thompson, the mastermind behind Yummy Tummy and a star of the Real Housewives of New York City. I won't be bullied and I won't lie down. I will fight it as hard as I can with my last breath. I will fight this. On the other side, Sarah Blakely, the billionaire owner and creator of hugely popular Spanx, whose company Thompson claims ripped off several yummy tummy designs, violating its patents. My heart dropped. I was like, oh my God, Spanx is knocking me off. The dispute hinges on the Yummy Tummy Slimming Tank, one of the most popular items at stores like Town Shop in New York City. The thing that was so beautiful about this is it has cotton on top, it has your girdle material in, in the tummy section where you need it, and then it has cotton on the bottom. So if you wear it underneath the blouse, it just looks like a regular camisole. And with the shapewear industry worth nearly a billion dollars a year, a lot is at stake. There's no larger growth in the lingerie industry. Earlier this year, Yummy Tummy's lawyers wrote a cease and desist letter to Spanx. And just overnight, Thompson posted an open letter directly to Blakely on the Yummy Tummy website. I needed to write it down, woman to woman, how I feel about this. But Blakely isn't getting her Spanx in a bunch over the claims. A company spokesperson tells ABC News Spanx has not infringed on any valid patent, and we will continue to make fabulous products for our loyal fans. Spanx's lawyers also filed a complaint asking a judge to rule on the disagreement in court. Do you, baby, because I'm doing me. If the dueling divas don't settle their differences, the intimate details of their businesses could soon be squeezed out for the whole world to see. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Janis, ABC News, New York. Wow, big money at stake mm -hmm. on that. All right, let's go upstairs to San Diego.